What's going on, everybody? Starting at 14 here. Welcome back to more Mario Plus Rabbits, The Sparks of Hope, the Rayman DLC, Rayman and the Phantom Show. So, we're going to be cleaning up the rest of the stuff around here because we wanted to do that so far. Because I want to 100% this area and see some things we didn't miss, we missed before. So, one thing I know for sure we missed was that in this area, in the old western set, there was an enemy that we could fight. So, let's get on over there and t take a whack at him for Pete's sake. Pretty sure it'll be easy. I mean, considering that we're full leveled now, I, I believe. I don't know, we might be under leveled anyway. But who knows? No, no, not that way, okay. Come on. Alright, so I'm just gonna go up here. And punch! Nice! Got a first punch in. Now let's see what kind of fight we're getting ourselves into. If it's a giant uh, princess smasher, we might need to use ice instead of wind. Oh, uh, here we go. Huh. Is the music on? Hold on. Not gameplay. Sound. No, the music's on. Okay. Yo! Yay! <laughs> okay, that's a fun little detail. We can do it. Okay. Oh, wait. I I didn't. Can I for one second? Okay. All right, let's get into this fight. So what kind of enemies are we dealing with? We're dealing with a, a Magnafowl, we're dealing with Princess, uh, Squashettes. Well, we're dealing with the Lone Guys who are also weak to ice, so we need ice and ooze, I believe. Yep, ice and ooze, alright. So, if that's the case, I think that, uh... I think Rabbit Mario should get Ooze Quake, and Rabbit Peach should get... Um, actually, you know what? Rabbit Mario should definitely get ice, if so that way he can freeze enemies so that they don't chase after him. That could be a good idea, but then again, considering the Magna Fowls, we could still get hurt. Hmm. I don't know, I'm gonna go full damage on this one, I think. So let me just upgrade this guy, come on little guy, eat, 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 eat! Just shove your fat boogery gullet with star bits. Alright, and we're good to go. Raymond, right, doesn't get star bits. Or star- Sprite. So it sparks! Can I speak, Bob? Please! Alright, so... First thing I think I can do... Is I'll use the rocket armor. Or, yeah, the rocket armor. To... Mm -hmm. Let's see, uh... Or actually, um, maybe it'd be a good idea now to use the uh, bounce armor. Yeah, the vortex guard. Right, sounds good. I'm gonna throw one over there. And boing! Bye-bye! Now this is what I call a dance show. Boing! 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 Oh! Alright. So that was actually a really solid amount of damage to them. Now, yeah, there's not really a way for the... Hmm. Okay, I'm thinking of possibly... Uh... Jeez, the music's kind of loud in my ear, sorry. Right. I'm thinking of probably doing a ton of damage to this guy. So I'm going to get Rabbit Mario up there. And bonk. And no! Uh... Okay, fine. I also see that uh, those guys are going to snipe at us if we're not careful. So, you know, we're just gonna stay back here. And since Rabbit Peach has long range, let's just snipe from over there. Now you fly. 
She is close to the Magnafowl's range, but I don't think he can lure her over there to him. It'd be ridiculous if he could, but I doubt he can. Yep, get him! Yep, death comes for you. Right. Nope, Quake can't reach him from up there. So, uh, turn's just about up. Let me get Revan Mario back here, and we're good. All right, come on, you nasty dogs. Hate these guys so much. Just, they shoot twice, so that you can, not only can they hit from afar, they can break cover. Mm. Okay, so they're not doing anything quite weird. Oh, no. Oh. What, the goal is to survive? Okay, I didn't know that. If I know that, I would have gone a completely different route. Dang it. I'm... Why do I never read these before starting? I, I just never do. Okay, two squash ants are going to come out of that tunnel. So let's go for rocket armor. Mm, yeah, let's just stay back here. Yep, let's use rocket ride. Hey, fly up. Now just push, and push. Uh oh, and... And blow him up! Alright, nice, nice. Mm, can I deploy guards over here, just in case? I think that would be a very good idea. Hmm... Yeah, got it. Got me some sentry defenses. Right, so if the snipers are going to be the biggest problem for us. So I'm thinking we should focus on attacking them. Alright. Come on. Yeah, that's perfect. And freeze, you buckos! You don't like ice, do ya? And that attack was... Oh, what? I forgot they can counter blow. Uh... Alright, so... Could I at the very least take out that guy up there with ooze? I'm gonna try to. Okay, good. Alright, that's good. And let's go. Yep. You can't get close enough to do anything to us. Yeah, so these guys are gonna come in. Mm -hmm. Okay, more squashettes. Easy. Just gonna move and move and move it over here. And Rabbit Peach, would you kindly escort yourself over here? Rabbit Mario will kindly use his fl large, thick head in order to keep you aloft for a moment. <laughs> and we're good to go. I like that the best method to this one is being cowardly. <laughs> I mean, like, it is good to fight the enemies, but again, if they're gonna keep spawning, it's often it's just best not to. I mean, in this case, we're probably gonna have to real quick. Ooh. Yeah, that's not good. So, Rayman. Yeah, uh, he can't reach that up there. He's got his Vortex costume ready, which is good. Okay, a little closer, please. Come on. Okay. Now fly, Rayman! Yep. And offward, onward! 
Yep, so we're gonna put two bouncers. Mm hmm I like that, you know, I actually watched a bit of Rayman 3 after, like, looking away from this for a while. And yeah, a lot of the costumes they have in that game are very reminiscent of the costumes here. So I think it really is a reference. Bye. Goodbye to you too. See ya. Ooh. Already, already. Alright, so now we need to get Rabbit Mario over here to try and do some damage. <laughs> Is there a way to hit all three of those guys over there? Ah, perfect! Okay, let's power up with some ooze damage. Oh wait, that's Toxic Quake! Yeah, that'll still do what I need it to. And boom, boom, boom! Sock him! Yeah. What was the Phantom saying about Rabbit Mario being a weakling exactly? He just punched three people, nearly killing all of them. And you're gonna call him a weakling? You've lost your mind. Uh, one second. Alright, sorry, we're back. Sorry, that was a phone call I had to take for a second. Mm, yeah, the sniper is definitely the worst one. And bing bada boom. Hmm, I could do some dash damage against him. Uh, let's see, can he get close enough? Nope. He could if he jumped, though. Hmm. Ooh, uh, that's a bad choice. Okay, let's just back off for now. The poison will probably kill them before, uh... uh bef sorry, before we can... At least I'm counting on it, too. Oh, no, it didn't work. Oh, boy, okay, they're, they're just gonna have their little jump party. Big dudes are a-marching it down here. Yep, shoving people out of the way. <laughs> I love that it shoves them out of the way. It's really funny. Nope. Boom. Oh dear. And boom. Nice shot, turrets. Alright, so I think the best job to do here is I gotta push these guys out of the way. Get, move, bit, get out the way. Get out the way, bit, get out the way. Move. Move. And as for you, absolutely move! Right, go, go, go! Hmm. And freeze him! Alright, now we can, uh, st skip our turn. <laughs> Dang, not even trying at this point, guys. If you want to fight me, get your sorry butts over here. But it, it, it won't matter soon. Oh, what, wait, what's coming out of there? Snipers? Uh-oh. Okay, that could be a problem. Just one turn left, though. And I think we got this in the bag. Hmm. You know, I'm I'm thinking we should just uh, try to freeze him. I don't want you coming anywhere near me. So luckily, either if you die from this, you still won't be a problem to me. Apparently princesses are weak to ice. Uh, sorry, this sorry to say, Elsa. Your power is also your own weakness, which actually kind of makes sense. Well, no, fear was her weakness in the movie, not the not the magic power itself. 
Mm, then again, it was also her parents that would kind of instigated that. Bam! Boom! Yeah, we're not done with you yet. Why do they just pathetically jump in place for the most part? Uh oh, I think, uh, likely Rayman might get hit from the sniper. Yeah, it doesn't look like he's behind cup. Oh, jeez. Okay. That guy got closer than I expected. Nope. Nope. Okay, here we go. Sniper, take your shot. Nope, we won. Nice. Oh, we were level 9. Okay, that was perfect. We got a gold gramophone for the works. Mm-hmm. I don't think- I don't think it's possible to lose that turn- uh, Yeah, I think it's impossible to not fail that turn limit. Meaning the whole point was just don't get knocked out. Yeah, nice one. Oh, cool! So if you beat the Phantom, now the ratings go up because of Rayman. Everyone, give yourselves a hand! <laughs> I, I heard someone clap, not, not me, but someone else in the audience. Right, so, again, I didn't see what a lot of everyone... So, that's one down. I don't know where all the others are. I mean, honestly, the map was pretty empty when I looked. Right, but that's a new weapon skin. Mm -hmm. Royal Pain. The operatic yeah. blaster is obtained. Good to hear. Now, as for the other uh, uh, mission coins, I didn't see them... Yeah, there's nothing here from the looks of it. Nope, nothing in the old, nothing in the medieval, nothing in the pirate stage, nothing in the old west. Oh, no, but I, I remember it telling me that there was a ton more mission coins. In fact, if anything, there was also another spark mission somewhere. Mm, yep. Yeah, so there's three memories left. There's five weapon skins at heal. The story progression is 100%ed, which is nice. So I gotta figure out where all of these different weapon skins are and where, where everything else could be. So I'll get back to you guys when I find them. Okay, so here's the first secret I think I found. It's this area back in the pirate section. So I think there was a whole platform section here that we didn't do. So let me just do that real quick. Let's see what's over here. Yeah, so I'm guessing we climb up here and at the top will hopefully be a secret. Uh, what? Okay, jumping down. What? Oh, I see. Sorry. There's a broken wall in the back. Alright, there we go. That's the first second atop the pirate watchtower. Alright, so here's the other secret. Behind this guy, there's a cracked wall back here. And inside is a memory turtle. Apparently, I didn't get this the first time, so Captain Ooh. Opera Beard. Yeah, Interesting, alright. Nice. Alright, so the next hidden item seems to be behind this wall here, but we gotta figure out where in this area there is the button to push it. So that's what I'll do right now, is I'm looking for a button uh, to push. <laughs> Okay, so here's the button. So apparently it's floating here above this uh, this jump platform, and so oh, and we landed right in the fire. Yeah. Okay, so with that, now we're able to get the item that we need. This is great. All right, I think that's the only secret in the medieval section. <laughs> now onto the others. Okay, everybody. So I was looking around and I couldn't find anything else until I realized that this is an area we have never gone into yet. I don't know why I didn't realize this is a room in Conintia, but j just watch. Like, I stepped into this room just a moment ago, and suddenly... Wait for it, come on, come on, load faster. All of this is in here. And another thing I didn't realize is that, yeah, we didn't even get to see Madame Boistuela in here yet. So, I'm thinking she's going to be somewhere around here, considering that a lot of her accessory pieces seem to yeah, be around here. Nice. So, but said, let's explore this area a bit. Make way. So, is, is that the phantom with like a steampunk? No, it's a rat with a steampunk face. I see a square <laughs> block up there. If we can just get to that jump pad. 
So let's get this teleportation block. Oh! There's a blue spark here. Why did I agree to this? Help! Uh, nothing works around here. I can't film a movie in the dark. Oh, so you're a movie director. Okay. This is a taping of the Galactic Wrestling Alliance. What's next? Steel cage? Elimination chamber? Ring of fire? Good lord, what are these rabbits watch? Rabbit Mario! Get some ladders and folding chairs! Mm. You know, I'd pay to see a Mario fight. <laughs> Wait! I recognize this ring! It must be for Spit Bucket Boy 3! The first two were hilarious! Hey, if you're a fan, maybe you'll help us finish on time? It's too dark in the ring, but I can't figure out how to turn the lights on. It should be easy. There should be an obvious switch up there. Which doesn't make any sense, but okay. Please, get the lights working. We're way behind schedule. You got it. Hold on. So, okay. I hope you guys uh, were okay with me finding those first two things around in the other areas. I didn't realize there was a... Like, again, I felt like there was something I was really missing. I don't know how I missed this. I, I guess I was expecting it to be, like, another room that we would be going into, like, for a set. Like, the, that the Phantom had set up, but... Maybe not. This is just one of the abandoned studio areas that apparently he left the Spark director to work with. There's an invisible bridge up there, but the bigger question is how do we... I mean, we should focus on getting to the light fixture. That's more important, but I'm just looking to see what else I can do around here. Seems like there are cranes around that we could uh, probably work with. Hmm. You know, maybe we could jump up to that uh, block crane. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, I'm guessing that's the control panel for the crane. Well, we made it. Okay, okay. So the light fixture is over there. Meaning we gotta maneuver some of the blocks over, so... There's a dark eye blocking that... What? There's the picture of a guard fruit or, or the, whatever the fruit that the guards are made of. Yeah, I think that'll work. Just fine. Well, the problem is that now we can't get up over to it. Yeah, that's the problem. Uh, hmm. Hey, there's stuff invisible here. So if we can get up to those blocks, then we can make it up there. But the question is, how do we... So, um, my guess is probably... Hmm. Oh! I think I get it. Hold up, hold up. I just figured it out. So we gotta turn it again. Hold on. Hurry, hurry. Run, run your fat butts over there. And... Nope, not like that. Yeah, just move it like this. Okay. But then we gotta find a way somehow to jump over onto that one. Hmm. I mean, the closest thing we can do, though, is turn the thing around to go this way. But that's literally what it, how it was said initially. And I see Madame Boistuela up there. Oh, I see. Turn. Right, there. We should be able to jump to the block now. So we gotta go this way first. Understood. Right, come on, Rayman. Fly with your little propeller hair. I wonder how that works for him. I mean, considering this is the guy that also has arms but no hands. I mean, oh my god, I'm so stupid. Hands but no arms. Completely back... I got it completely backwards. Oh my goodness. Also, that is a weird-looking face over there. I'm still... Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. All right, hey, Madame Boisrella. Our next caller says she's being doom-shamed by her boss at work. Hello, are you, uh, are you there? Welcome. Ladies and gentlemen, it appears that Madame Boisrella's dimensional drift departures has some surprise guests. Due to a nasty network lawsuit, episodes of commercial free combat will not grow our viewers your viewership. So are you in or out? Uh, I'm still in. And action Your thing, Madame Boswella. You are certain it is combat you seek beyond the dimensional drift? Speak up for the audience at home, please. 
Of course we are. We're ready, Madame Bussoir. So interesting, she's got her own like little fortune telling show as well. It's like, like it's called being doom shamed or something. Yeah, you know, it's always Madame Bussoir and always with doom. But we wouldn't have it any other way. Right, so I'm wondering how difficult this fight is going to be. I I don't I doubt I don't think it's gonna be too hard. But overall, I'm glad we have a lot more than I was expecting. I was expecting this to just kind of be like a really small cleanup episode, but I think we're going to have a good amount of stuff in here to begin with. So we got to defeat all the enemies. question is, what kind of enemies are we dealing with? Oh boy, we're dealing with magicians. I hate them. Okay, so ooze is a big... So big emphasis on ooze. So, Rabbit Mario will have ooze... You even have, like, the Quake ability. Um... Hmm, okay, so we... Electricity could be helpful. But what I would also like is... Uh, perhaps... Mm, just think, think, think for a second. Hmm... I don't know about a Quake ability. I don't know about that, but... Mm. Oh, let's go with invisibility. That way, I guess for the most part, we can uh, do well the best we can. So, I think first, amen, kill all those guys. Yeah, there's stooges and depleters all over the place. So, I guess we'll just go like uh, enemy by enemy. So, hop over, vault over. I know you can do it. Alright, shock attack. Let's hit that depleter in the back. Yep, get him! Alright, that didn't do a lot of de I mean, that did a decent amount of damage to him, but... Didn't do as much damage as I wanted. I think we'll be okay if we just hobble over here. I would've liked at least to get rid of that stooge. And come on, take him out. So Raymond can jump over there because of the rings, so that could be helpful. Especially with all the magicians around. Alright, we'll keep everyone behind some solid cover. Um, Oh, actually, Rayman could make it over to that end. Yep. Let's fly, Rayman. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Alright. So let's use the rocket ability. Alright, everyone, get down. Get down. Boom, boom, bing, bada, boom. Come on and bounce off the hill. Yeah, just bounce them seven ways to Sunday. Yep, that should do a good amount of damage. Right, that stooge is gonna hit him for a. Oh, I. Right, that was weird. I couldn't move. Here, yeah, okay. So rabbit peach can't move, but everything should be fine. Yep. Not a chance. You're not gonna hit Rayman. Luckily, he's immune to the super effects, but I I don't think vampire counts as a super effect. Meaning it's still probably going to hit him, because I know there's a depleter down in that pipe and he'll probably go up to hit Rayman, is what I'm expecting. Right, yep, all these guys just... Yeah, what is with, like, the countless amounts of magicians? And I, I hate it when they heal spam. It's... And... Ouch. Alright, now he has the counter-attack ready. There was a guy up there! Shoot! No! Ouch. Yeah, all of them, they're gonna move now. The stooge is gonna do his thing. There's another stooge down there. Yeah, all the stooges get their turns. 
Hmm. All right, all right. Mm, okay, so now we gotta do something about these guys. I'm thinking that maybe we could just do something like this. Mm. I mean, what I should do is just get out of dodge. So I'm gonna, yeah, I think setting up some bounce defenses would be very helpful for us here. So I'm gonna put him over there. Come on, bounce over. Okay, good. Uh, they're mostly in range. I'm trusting this will hit him. Nice, solid damage. Oh no, counterattack. Nice, it missed. Mm -hmm. So I think what I'm going to do is going to try and take out this guy in the back. I say that as probably Rabbit Mario has nowhere to jump. Oh no, he's... He could walk over there and punch him. What am I talking about? Heck, he could even make it easier for us by throwing the... The guards wherever I, I wish. Just beat him up! All right, all right, all right. Um, now, as for you, um, move a little bit. A uh, little more. Okay, they're both in range. It's gonna hit multiple times, so it's gonna break that shield. Mhm. Mm right. So I think we'll just stay back here until. For the most part, it's safe. I think we're all safe over here. It's getting up there with all those guys that I think will be a serious problem. The problem is these guys set up shields as well as heal. They are a bad combo of supporter. But that's just what makes them all the worse. A rock I bet uh, we could use Rayman's rocket ride soon. Yeah, everyone, come on. Oh, I think, uh... Actually, I forgot, what's the turn limit on this? The turn limit is, uh... Oh, there is no turn limit, from the looks of it. No, I don't see it, okay. Hmm. Alright, so let's use Rayman to get Rabbit Mario over there. He should be able to get back with... Hopefully, most of his skin intact. Right, we shouldn't... I mean, I could dash into him and not get uh, poisoned, because he's got a poison spark. Mm. Alright, alright. So now, jump back to safety. Come on, come on. You to be close enough to the pipe. Good. Right, so now, yeah, Rayman sadly can't do anything. Hmm. Uh, yeah, a little closer. Right, let's heal real quick, actually. I don't want to be caught with my pants down and suddenly just have a character knocked out. Hmm. Ooh, uh, yeah, Mario, get back behind this cover. As for Rabbit Peach, it might be good to take out that guy. Hmm. Yeah, he can't do anything in this position. Uh, I sh actually, let me double check that depleter over there. Hmm, okay, she's behind both covers, so sh he sh she should be safe. Hmm. I feel bad that we just barely couldn't kill those guys over there, because now they're going to waste all their time healing each other up. Uh, rings? Yep. I don't know, uh, maybe Rayman could get a shot at one of them. If I can get rid of at least one of them, I'll be okay. 
<laughs> Got you. Say bye. Uh oh, oh no, not a cl no zero chance, really. Oh, come on. All right, I guess I'll set these guards up just in case. I doubt they'll do anything though. Jump through the hoop. Is there anyone else nearby? Uh, doesn't look like it. I guess we could just hit those Goombas. And... Boom! Oh, and we got a POW block from them. Nice! I forgot we had that upgrade. Yeah. Uh, we'll stay... Actually, uh, just... Since that... So, there's nobody up there anymore. Uh, Rabbit Mario would be better off... He oh. Ah, oh, that's one dead one. That's another one. And then all that's left is this guy. Interesting that they chose to move first instead of using their abilities. I mean, I have... By playing this, I have learned a lot about the patterns of enemies. <clears throat> the biggest one being is that they won't... Is that if they're out in the open, they will never risk attacking you if it means they'll get shot in the process, so... They will always hide behind cover, never leaving themselves exposed. Which... Which is a good thing if... If, like, they're... Which can be a good thing sometimes if you're trying to maneuver them into a position where the cover is useless for them. Alright, let's charge up some electricity. And how about a shock to you? No. Bing bada boom. Dead? Dead. Yep, dash into him. Yeah, so I'm thinking we go rocket ride on this guy. Just goodbye. 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 Hit the road. And boom. Yep, he's dead. Alright, we're doing pretty good. We got most of the enemies killed and not many of us have been attacked. Can I reach that hoop ring from here? Nope. Mm, I see... Yeah, everyone's over there. They're gonna make their way towards me soon. So you know what? I think I'll set up some guards. Hey. That'll be helpful. Just throw them over there as they make their way over here. They'll blow up most of the cover in the process. Alright, sounds good. Everything's fine. Alright, show them what you got, fellas. Yeah, they're all fine where they are. They're not gonna move, I guess. And he's just gonna move one spot. It is kind of nice to not have to deal with the turn, like, limit for the golden gramophone. Because it doesn't apply to this. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. Right, this is a, probably a very stupid idea. But again, I don't have to care that much about my characters dying for the most part. So let's just give them all the bluebonic plague. Well done, fellas. Yep, kill them all. And boom. MVP, MVP. Mm-hmm. All right, all right. Uh, so let's go back this way. Let's see if Rayman can help out uh, Rabbit Mario. I think he can. So. Yep, plunger guard. Let's do it. Yeah, I'm wondering what those fruits are. Like, in Rayman initially, because I, they can't be just sentry guns. That wouldn't make a lot of sense. Come here, you. And boing, boing, boing. And pew, pew, pew. Yep. Hmm. 
I'm still trying to figure out what that one ability is. Like that one charge thing. I don't think... Oh no, I'm gonna feel stupid by the time I find out what it is. I'm gonna make sure this guy dies. <laughs> that was a creepy laugh that Rabbit Peach just had there for a moment. <laughs> like, that was legit pretty scary. Uh, yeah, Magician, this guy's gonna run and heal himself. I'm fine! <laughs> I'm fine! Yep. And now the punch of poison. Power me up. And BAM! And imagine your ability to be punching boogers. That'd be, that'd be horrible. Or just, like, anything gross in general. Move, move. You can vault over, Rayman. Because I know your character. At least for the most part. Okay, okay, move, 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 move. Yep. And now I'm gonna plunge a gun you. Dang, yeah, give me your money. And Rabbit Peach is able to hit him from here because she can hit behind cover. Go for it! Even though that is part of Rayman's cover. Eh, I can heal him up. Oh, and he died anyway. Alright, easy. Not too tough of a battle, gotta say. Right, with that, we're done. Now we can move on to cleaning up the rest of the mess around here. Yeah, but... I can't believe I missed all this stuff. I'm glad we, I'm glad we found it, though. Yep, that's one of the effects there. Now we just need to find the rest of the memory turtles, as well as the last, uh, coin. Okay, from the looks of it, uh, this only led to that, which is kind of disappointing. Mm. Here, let me see. What can this lead? Oh, I see how it can lead to, uh, there, over there. All right. Oh, is he gonna make it? He's gonna make He's not gonna make it. Dang it. And we can't reach that crane control either. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's what it was. Literally, the block... The block that we needed for this was right there the whole time. I am so sorry about that. Okay, but that opens that up. So... Now what? Yeah, nice. Okay, I'm. Th I think I'm starting to regret calling myself dumb for a moment because you know what? Uh, actually, never mind. Scratch that. That was the solution this whole time. I have been here for the past 20 minutes looking around for the solution and it was simply that. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's hurry up and get the... Yeah, over there. Alright, so now we should be able to fly over at last and be able to free the crane controls. Okay, come on. Image is right. Image is right. And boom, you're dead. Yeah. Oh my goodness. That that was way more frustrating than it needed to be. And honestly, I'm kind of ashamed that, that that's why it took me forever. It's just that there was a movable block. Well, it doesn't matter. Come on, let's glide over. Fly your little propeller head. While carrying two rabbits on you. And boom, landed smack dab on the coins. Come on, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it. Okay, there's nothing over here, but there's something over here. 
And made it up. Okay, thank goodness. Okay, put it down for a second. There we go, there we go. Ready to fly. Now move over here. Right, and finally we can just start. what's up? I can't work in these conditions. My artistic vision has been compromised by darkness. Oh, I think, oh gosh, I forgot what his name was, but I know, I know it's the artist. I don't see darkness pedal on my prop list. Can you get it cleared out for me? Ah. Sure thing. Oh, First, I want to nice. see. So this is the next green screen scene with the Ooh. Planet Coin Award. Okay. So if I'm correct, that should be one of the last of the Planet Coins. And with this, this should be one of the last few mem memory turtles. I actually think there's one more, and it's after we clear out that puddle. Okay, okay, let's let's do it then. The whole point is that we're trying to get the light fixture uh, built. Yeah, nice. So yeah, let's let's do the darkness puddle first. Sorry, I was debating over what I wanted to do. All right, darkness puddle, and then we'll get the light fixture done. Right, come on, spin those, spin that here. And off we go. Art at stake. Let's do it. Ugh, it. Took forever to finally get up here. But still, pretty interesting of a set, I gotta say. Okay, so are we gonna have like a cool green screen effect around us or something? That would be kind of cool, actually. Kind of like in Luigi's Mansion 3, where one of the boss fights, literally you're being filmed as a movie... And it's easily one of the best bosses just for that reason alone. Oh boy. Actually, this should be a bit... Oh no, spell razors! Oh, for crying out loud. Okay, we definitely need electricity. Right, we got it. Uh, we also need a means to push people out of the way if need be. So I'm gonna power him up. Yeah, we got plenty of star bits. I think we'll be fine. Right, eat, little wind guy, eat! Right, so I'm gonna give that to Rabbit Mario, and then I'm gonna give him uh, the other wind ability. We can do it! Yep, we're darn right we can. Right, rocket blast! So, yep, shove it out of the way. Shove you off the cliff. Jeez, they don't take a lot of damage from this, do they? And... Alright, extra damage from that. That's nice. Mm. I mean, again, they don't have moves to bring in closer, but... That is kind of close. Alright. Uh, you know, yeah, let's dash into them. Hmm. Oh, right, and then as for Rabbit Mario, we could just shove him away. Let's do it. First dash into both of them. And let's just give him the old twister punch. Yep, now you guys will fudge off. And bing 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 bong be like ping pong balls. Nice, and he fell off the edge and died. Alright, is anyone in range of my attack? Nope, nobody over there. Alright, so I think we're fine where we are. Oh yeah, don't forget those guys have sniping range. Yeah, I get it. More stooges. And wild cats and... Oh, wild claws, more specifically. And riptides. Mm-hmm. Right, so one thing I think we could do with Rayman is jump over there. And then kind of lure everybody in, I think. I don't know. I don't think we can reach Goodbye. them yet. Yeah, let's upgrade our shock attack. Or... 
So yeah, let's get him. Boom! Yeah, he he got pissed about that one. And yep, get you. Right, and let's just blow them all away with wind. And the spell raisers are weak to wind. Right, good, 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 good. And then we can kill this guy. If only we could punch him from over here. Uh, we can't hit him from there. Damn it. Right, so Rabbit Mario just has to be out of range or be in range of an attack for this. And it'd be worth it to get the guy killed, so. Nope, nothing over- can't get over there. But I could see if I could just try to get some turret defenses down over to Rabbit Mario. Yeah, not gonna happen. Dang! Yeah, see what I tell you, sniper range. This one makes them so awful. Ow! Oh great, portals. You're gonna hate that that won't hit him directly. But this will! Come on, full damage, full damage! Nice! Alright, that's one guy down and my battery's low. No worries, don't worry about it. Dad, we'll be able to finish this in time. Oh yeah! Boom, boom, boom! Yep, and get them both! Nice! That is what I like to see. I just blast him. Right, anything else? Nope. Oh, I can dash into him. Might as well. Right, so we don't know who specifically he's going to go after, so let's just huddle up over here. We have one turn to kill one more enemy, and guess what? It's going to be Mr. Uh, big Dude over there. All right, yeah, come on. Stop taking your shots. We got it. Hmm. All right, so yeah, we got two more guys coming up, but it doesn't matter. Oh, we got this, we got this, come on. All right, we get it, we get it. A conga line of wild claws, but it doesn't matter. So, uh, I guess... Right, I know what I know the first thing I'm gonna do. I'm gonna set up some turrets. Because when he starts running after, uh... Rabid Mario, after socking him in the face... I wanna make sure he bounces far away. You know what? Let's boost up some damage as well. And BAM! BOOM! There we go, that's how we do it. Got us a gold gramophone. Nice, so we reached level 10. Got a boost in our power. And got ourselves the gold gramophone. Lots of... All good, all good. Oh, and our ratings went up too. Same here, Rayman, I feel great. Well, you know, great's better than good. Now that's for action-packed entertainment! Yeah, interesting to see that our view ratio view, uh, count is going up, despite the fandom no longer being here.
But it's cool to see that, like, if you beat the Phantom before doing all this, you get to see Rayman in that light instead. It could, I guess, emphasizing how Rayman's truly earned his uh, place back up and f stuff. I have worked in every medium imaginable. Animatronics is the noblest art form of them all. My promotion to assistant animatronic supervisor is a sure thing now. All thanks to you. Well, glad to hear, buds. Oh, yeah. Right, but now we actually need to maneuver everything up. So, Sorry. All right, come on. Just gotta maneuver the cranes. Yeah, it's gonna take a bit. Yeah. Just turn this one around. Come on, turn. Turn. <laughs> right, so what we're gonna do is gonna fly over here. And make our way all the way back to the light fixture. Ow. Sorry. <laughs> hey, come on, fly, 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 fly. Oh, that was a close one. All right, keep flying. Oh, wait, hold on a minute. There's actually something over there. W what is that? There's something like beyond over there for a second. I don't know if we've seen it already, but I want to double check. Oh, the great, there's no way over to it. Right. Uh, no, no, there's a way over. There's a way over, all right. Just do this. And, boom. Oh, so it's another dark mist puddle, okay. Oh, it's Sullivan! My documentary! For decades, I've labored over its research, accuracy, and soundtrack, and now this! Oh, don't worry, don't worry, we'll fix it for you. In the puddle known as train wreck. <laughs> yeah, I think it's cool that we get to see all the different characters of the different DLCs come over here. We got to see Sullivan, we got to see uh, the Dry Red and Sweet Lepec, we got to see DJ Cheap Tuna, we got to see the, uh, the Brewmaster... I forget what his name is. I think we got to see Auntie B as well. Alright, so, oh, so the goal is to destroy eyes. Oh, that'll be easy. What well, won't be easy is taking care of these dudes, though. We can do it! Alright, well, I know what to do. First thing I'm gonna do is just shove all of you fudge faces away. Go! Yep, I'm gonna blow ya! Pause on that! Big pause on that! Oh, that's... Alright. Oh. Alright, alright, so... Yep, just punch him! Good, no more oozers. Indeed! Oh, dang, there's one all the way up there? Jeez. We have to do this in three turns. So I gotta make this rocket ride count. Right. Yep, got that eye. And bye. <laughs> Alright, I think we can easily hit that one eye over there. Wait, are they- are they weak- to, are they resist shock? Oh, they resist ooze! Yes! That means I can boost my damage up with shock. I got a tasing rocket launcher. <laughs> I can either brutally kill them or still brutally kill them. Alright, Rayman. Fly over here. Kick this guy in his metaphorical tush. And looks like uh, Rayman stuck. Oh, wait, no, he's immune to the super effect. I, I remember. Alright, that was a good move with the rocket uh, ride over there to get uh, the eye way over there. Really helpful. Wait, why did he get to attack twice? That was weird. Alright, portals are coming in. 
Oh, there was two of them. That's why... <laughs> Sorry, one guy didn't attack twice. There was just two of them. All right, uh... Ah, nice! She can hit it from there. All right, that's one eye down. Can Rayman hit that last one? And boom! Easy! Nice! Got another golden gramophone for the books! Yep, powering up. 40 coins. So many star bits that we don't need. And another golden gramophone. That is what I like to see. And we get our view ratings up! And... Boom! Audiences are in love! So I'm guessing that last thing we're gonna do is probably gonna fill it up to the very top. But, right, but... So I'm guessing with the Phantom gone, I'm guessing, do we run the studio now? I mean, could be a good business. You never know. I also like that it's the puzzle from the... From inside the tree. I am to purchase a tiny male crane. Uh, and later, a miniature creamery. It is why I am so destitute. Or, oh, I am destitute. Okay. Alright. Uh. Alright, well, how do we get out of here? Right, we did what we needed to do here, so... Oh. That would explain it. It's hard to see the symbol on those blocks, I gotta say. I think that's why I think not to uh, p push on them like that. Also, we have to reset the cranes. So that's all fine, I guess. Right, so just move you over, Mr. Crane. Come on. Right. I'm really hoping that this uh, area is going to be the last memory and the last uh, mem, well, last well, last turtle, but also the last uh, a coin. Hopefully, I'll need to see the progress we've done. Uh, yeah, we've almost gotten. Uh, we got one more memory. We got five weapon skins. I don't know how we're gonna get the. Oh wait, duh! We can buy them in the shop. <laughs> Boom! Alright, so we did get all the coins because there's nothing else to buy in the store, so... I guess I'll just buy a bunch of items. There we go. Alright, let's fly, Rayman. And leap of faith. Oh, I said leap of faith. Come on, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it. No! Okay, you should have made it. What the heck? And you really gotta time your jumps, don't you? Right. Come on, please make it this time. Please. Please. Why? <sighs> okay, I guess we won't have. I guess we don't have to do it that way. We could do it like this, probably. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep, just flying around. It's kind of lame that there's not any music right now, but the music settings are on, so... Finally. What I've been trying to get up here forever. Now I can finally get up here. Yep. Come on, keep going. Keep going. You know, what was the... You know, considering the complex puzzle we had to do, what was the point of the block... Of like this blocking the whole thing was it just so that we could instigate the or just enable this situation first before doing that because that seemed a little uh, excessive also I like this homage to the initial Mario Rabbit this was uh, 
the toilet with the rubber duck in it, obviously, but this was in the Mario Rabbids Kingdom Battle World. At least I remember a giant toilet that had moss on it. Alright, lighting's on. Let's watch a wrestle match. What gives? We got the lights on. Why aren't they fighting? Uh, let's go see what's the matter. Maybe it's not too late to film a tag team tornado ladder match. <laughs> Honestly, I'd be up for that. Pretty please. Just one little punch. You'll hardly feel it. Where's my stunt double? When's my safety meeting? I don't even have boxing gloves. Yeah, you're a horrible director, I gotta say. Sorry. I'll do it! I haven't read the script, but I got my own gloves! Pick me! Can I be in it? Uh, I don't have the boxing gloves, but I have speed, agility, plus I'm great at legwork. Ironically. Legwork? Really? Anyways, I'm in. I can outbox both of these chumps. It sounds dangerous, but... Bucket Boy franchise does have a lot of fans. Okay, let's do it. Sounds great. Time for a boxing match with everyone involved. Boom! <laughs> we got the jump on him first. So is this like a mini boss sort of situation or just a regular fight? Or can we only attack through punching? That would be that actually would be an interesting mechanic there. Like if we have to fight using only certain moves because of the show. I mean, it wouldn't be a boxing match if we had guns to use. Maybe Rabbit Mario could get away with his dukes. But I'm not sure. Right, I guess not, so. We're dealing with Magnafowls, which have ooze on them. There are stooges everywhere. Oh lord, and Rabbit Peach is not safe. And my battery's dying on me. It should be fine. Everything will be fine. Right, so I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna have her with invisibility. Mm. And, uh... Let's think, let's think here. Um, Do I want wind on him? I'll take the wind dash instead. That should be good. That should be really helpful to us. Right, and a Rayman can do his own thing. Nope, so... Yep, let's just do this. Let's set up some turrets. And kick! Yep, nice, nice. Alright. So, if I could just get him up here. Yep, let's do it! Poison! Uh. All right. Hmm. Kind of a shame. Oh wait, no. Uh, Rayman, shoot him. All right, all right. So I'm gonna kick you. I'm gonna turn myself invisible because that would probably be the best course of action right now. Yeah, we just gotta focus our attacks on the... on these guys. Of course, it wouldn't help to get rid of the other dudes around. Hmm. Eh, nope. Can't jump anywhere. Just punch him! Again, that's such a cool ability. Yeah, you missed, buddy. Ah, uh, I hate that. I hate that you did that so much, actually. Oh, and he didn't die from poison. Yikes. Lord, okay, hey, enough hitting Rabbit Mario, yeesh. Right, can I use Rocket Ride to break their shields off? Bounce in there. Bouncing again. Bouncing again. 
All right, I'm just gonna kill you. Because I just don't want you on our pedestal anymore. All right, let's get Rabbit Peach in a fairly safe uh, position. And she can just give him the old one, too. Oh, we gotta... Oh, no! Oh, crap, we're not gonna be able to... Oh, wait, maybe we can. Hold on. I think we can do this. Okay. Right, yeah, let's jump. Ooh, oh. Uh, I should have gotten towards the edge. Oops. Okay, okay. And push him, push him in. Just, uh, just soccer ball kick him. All right, all right. Oh, nice. Right, that shot should definitely kill him now. Nice! We did it! Oh, that was a close one. I didn't realize the turn limit there. Well, at least until the very end. But we did it! Got another golden gramophone. And again, not really a boxing match if we can use guns. But, eh. Whatever entertains the folks, I guess. I feel good! Same here. Now, is that our last rating boost? It is! I think we're a hit! Nice! Alright, that's all of the boost we need then. So, what else do we got here? I'm curious to see. So, I'm thinking what's left is gonna be probably, uh... Yep, quest complete for boxing ring. Uh... Oh, sorry, I thought for a second the game crashed. I was kind of scared there. What a fight! Makes Spit Bucket Boy 2 look like a spelling bee! But you put a good... Can you put in a good word for me with the Phantom in case there's a Spit Bucket Boy 4? <laughs> yeah, I don't think the Phantom's coming back anytime soon, but let me look at the progress bar so far. Uh, okay, we're missing a memory. Hmm... But nope, that's all of the stuff in the main missions. So if we just find this main memory, we'll be good. All right, good news, everybody. I was able to find out where the last uh, memory is. So apparently, you go back here, and here it is. Oh, nice! Took me forever to find this crack in the wall. I didn't see it was there. I could have sworn we got everything here, but let's see. Is that everything? Is that truly everything in this area? That's it! Now, one last gift is in return for us. The Legendary Blaster for Rayman. Man. To think... I can't believe it. Sparks of Hope is now over. It's all done. There was a long journey to get here. No. I think this game series was definitely un definitely underrated. Well, I think it's very fun. Considering again the concept, this game surprised me in how fun it is and how hilarious it is. And I really hope they do make another sequel to this series. Maybe Rayman could re truly cross over with uh it's Mario, who knows. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the series. <laughs> <laughs> Having Mario confused why he has no legs. <laughs> well, I'm trying to have an emotional sign off here, but I guess it's ruined now. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this series. If you want more of it, hopefully they'll have another in soon. Or if you just want me to do more Tower of Doom, I'll gladly do that. With that being said, until then, I'll see you guys then. Bye! <laughs>